I just think the benefits of art therapy are understated. It's got nothing to do with being able to draw. It's got nothing to do with having a talent of like representing what you see. It's about representing what you feel and it's about the process. I think it's a it's very undeveloped profession. When I first came back, I was one of two art therapists in the country. So I trained in the UK and when I returned, it was pre Mandela, sort of it was just when he was released and pre him being elected as president. So there was a lot of work to be done, sort of in particularly in the areas most affected by violence. And so a lot of my work was based there. And it was really from that, that, that sort of the need became absolutely apparent around people needing to do more of what our therapy can offer. I had known before that art therapy is not offered in South Africa as um, a something after school like, um, but I just, I just um, googled it and this came up and I was so excited, <laughs> I was so excited. Um, I think for me it's, it's a way that I can use uh, my form of communication to empower other people to use it as well in a helpful way. Um, I think especially with Lefika, we work with a lot of um, disadvantaged kids that um, come during Open Studio or one of the many groups that we run. It, um, and since our government is like limiting visual arts at school, it's also a big problem. So when they do come and they express themselves and they come to a place where it's safe, it feels safe and you're not being judged and we kind of, we describe ourselves as surrogate parents for the afternoon and to give them a way to relate with um, adults in a different way because where they come from, not necessarily a positive role model exists. Mm -hmm. So that's why they come here for, and that's how we engage with them. Well, I think we have a huge, again, another kind of a crisis in the country, which is that there are huge limitless needs and not enough resources. So the thing that's driven the organization and driven me is really about making accessible art therapy and community, what we've called community art counseling, available to people who are actively working in communities, whether it's as care workers or artists or activists or that are already doing extraordinary work but just need the skills to be able to work more deeply. We work very um, interactively here, you know, the, the way we trained is very experienced, we, 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 we train through learning, so um, we go through the counselling process ourselves, we are counselled and then just sort of through that you, you become the counsellor, yeah.